Hello and welcome back to another video where today I'm going to be showing you how to get gems in Image Chicken Simulator. So, there's many reasons why you might want gems. You might want to buy some game passes or you might want to open one of the black hole orbs right here. There's loads of different reasons you might need gems, you might need some boosts. But today in this video, I'm going to be going over the three quickest, easiest, and best ways to get gems that I know of. So, first method is just going to be just over here, which is the tower place. In the tower place, to fight a bunch of bosses and a bunch of NPCs and you win rewards from it as you can see here floor one two three five hundred and for every 10 uh, floors you complete you get 2500 gems so you do 100 floors you're getting 500 gems for every single floor you complete and every 10 floors you get an extra 2500 when an extra award normally like that one there I got a boost this one here I got talent tokens this one here I got equipped too which is uh, lets me equip more stuff and it gave me a luck boost so the rewards and tower are really good and it's really easy to do. My level is really hard, so I'm going to show you because it will take me a long time because I'm on uh, floor 124 at the moment. But for you, no matter where you're in, it should be really easy and you should be able to fly through it. It just keeps elevating you up and up and lets you fight a bunch of NPCs on the floor. It is a lot quicker if you have the auto attack, which is a game pass. But that would be the reason why you're watching this video because you want to try and get the auto attack. So you might not have this, but if you do, it's a lot quicker with that. And that is the first and easiest method to get gems in this game and it gives you the most gems. Second method to get gems is doing quests. As you can see this guy here, Scientist Bob, in front of the tower. He will give you a quest before you even touch the tower, and he'll give you a bunch of gems. He'll tell you to go to your boost, to upgrade your radius, which is your auto attack and pickup radius, but you don't necessarily have to spend your gems on this. If you want to, you could just go straight to your store and buy a game pass, like I bought all these game passes here. But me personally, I upgraded my uh, radius a few times because I wanted it for my auto attack. But he gives you free gems, you don't have to use it on that, but he tells you to. You can just ignore him and then spend the gems whatever you want. And there's also a lot of other quests, not just this quest, but there is the Soul Queen quest, which is the spirit quest, uh, killing the boss a hundred times, and it gives you 10,000 gems, which is quite a lot of gems. But yeah, quest is probably the second best way to get gems. It's probably a lot quicker than power, depending on which quest you're doing. Like this guy just gives them away for free, but it's probably the second quickest way or second most convenient way because the power gives a lot more gems overall but that's the second way you can get a lot of gems really fast now the third way you can get a bunch of gems is you can do this at any point in the game you don't have to be advanced in the game you don't need to complete any quests you don't have to be grinding this is definitely the easiest of all three probably said this one's the easiest because i'm i'm kind of rushed in this video but this one is definitely the easiest but it doesn't give you that many gems compared to the other two the other two give you a lot more gems overall this one won't give you a certain amount of gems, but it is the quickest, and that is codes. If you click the store button right here, you scroll all the way down, you hit, see here, redeem codes. And I would tell you the codes, but I've already done a video on that. A link to that will be in the description. I, I actually, I'll put it in the comments and I'll pin it. So if you want to uh, watch the video of all the codes, so you can know what codes to use, all the current working codes I've done a video on, link to that will be in the comments, so go check that out. And those are the top three ways. That'll give you about 20, 30k gems, somewhere in between there, depending on what codes are active at the time. As of the time we're recording this, I think it gives you about 23,000 gems, but it also gives you a bunch of boosts, a bunch of talent tokens. Like, as you can see here, I've got a coin boost, XP boost. It gives you a bunch of stuff like this. It gives you talent tokens, which help you reroll your stats on your champion. And it also gives you premium quirk reroll tokens, which are really OP. So on top of gems, you also get a lot of other perks. But yeah, that is the third way you can get a lot of gems. The easiest, but it doesn't give you as much consistent gems as the other two. This isn't a method you're going to use if you're trying to get game passes over and over. You just use the codes and that's it, it's done. But that is the quickest way. If you did enjoy this video, please like and subscribe. Comment if there was any methods I missed in the comment section below. That is it. Join the Discord in the description if you would like to. Thank you for watching and goodbye.